We should shower shaved. Now, we're going on a little road trip for the first part of the day. Um, gotta go to, I think, Beeville. Drop off some stuff for my pops. I actually gotta go to ABC first, pick up the stuff, and then go. So, Charlie, hush. How you doing? All right, we're loaded down. 107 foot, 100 foot, 200 foot, low down, and we're on the way. Ah, God damn. Hour and 45 minute drive. Cruising. Straight cruising. This motherfucker's got a 96 foot piece. Hold up, it was coming out their ass in. Check this out, fucking crazy. And then fucking 96 foot. If I need to lift it up a little bit, maybe. Got missing hangers. Oh shit, that shit bending. Oh my god. Crazy. Do you know what uh what this is? That right there is a citation for guess what? Guess what? A damn registration. So guess where we're at? Inspection time, buddy. Look. We are about to be here for ever. 15 days past due. So we're about to be here forever. I already ate a good old number nine with some hash browns on there. No fries, hash browns, that's the way to go. Didn't get ranch, but that's another another option you got. Suete. So I'm gonna be chilling here. My phone's almost dead. I'm on like 6%. So that's another thing going my way. Um, and then all the houses I was gonna do, I had five houses, one already rescheduled, another one already rescheduled. So that's two. And then we got three left. It's already like 2.30. It's gonna be a motherfucking day and a half here. It was great, man. So this cop was an asshole. Might as well tell you the story. So I was coming back from Beaverville. I was fucking hauling ass, which is not a good idea because on 181, it drops, like, the, the speed limit drops, like, all the time. It's, like, 65, 60, 55, 45, 45, 55, 65, 65, 50, 45. Like, you go through all these, like, small towns and shit. And um, I was hauling ass, right? Boom! I went to go past someone. I passed him. Boom! Right over the hill was a cop. I was all fuck. I was going like 80. It was like a 65. And I was all fuck, you know. And uh, so I was all oh, shit. So I just stopped, like slow down. And uh, I was all, all right. What the fuck, ever, you know? I get in front of the car that I was going in front of. It was. It actually turned into two lanes. So I stayed in that left lane, and I was looking out my window, like out my mirror. I was like, fuck, dude, like, this guy going, I, I heard, I saw him hit the brakes, like, twice. I was like, fuck, man, this guy's going to come, give me a speeding ticket. So, you know, like, right after that, I was like, I knew what time it was, I was like, fuck. So I put my seatbelt on, I fucking start going all slow and shit, like, going the speed limit, like, you know, I was just going to tell him, I was just passing that guy, and my truck picks up speed fast, so that's why I hit 80, you know what I mean, but... It didn't come to that, cause this guy got, he turned around, I saw him turn around in my rear view. And I was already like, damn near half a mile ahead of him. But, he caught up to me, you know, cause I wasn't trying to go speeding off or, I had nowhere to turn, so it's just like, like 37, it's just like road, and then you get to like a small town maybe. 
and then like there's nothing really out to the side so you can't really go nowhere dip nowhere to like hide or anything so i was like fuck you know so he slowly creeps up on me and we get to this little short town small town not short small town and right when we get into the first stoplight after that thing turns green like you have a couple like restaurants or, or buildings or whatever he flicks on his diet tell oh fuck i knew it like i thought he was gonna let me go like just follow me for a little bit and make sure i'm not gonna take off again or just fucking scare the shit out of me you know what i mean but now he hit it on his last a lot of shit so i went and i parked in like uh some little motel or some something like that and it was all hey been stopped for the registration i was like fuck man damn that sucks because i was gonna get this shit done as soon as everything slowed down which is like in like five days so i was all you know I'm, i wasn't too worried about it and then of course, of course. So, hopefully, like if I get this all done today or like within the next couple of days and I call the judge or talk to someone, I might be able to get like dismissed or something. Uh, but yeah, it just sucks. I'm just glad that I didn't get a speeding ticket, dude. I've gotten too many of those. And those things cost a shit ton. I don't know how much this citation even cost, but nothing is cheap, you know. It's, it's it sucks paying like shit you really could avoid it paying, you know what I mean? But shit, you gotta be on point from now on, buddy. Can't be doing this shit. It's a waste a lot of time. After waiting for an hour and like 30 minutes in that line, I got to the front, handed him my thing. You had to show him like your insurance. I knew mine was expired, but it had like a little pin number or whatever. And the police officer that pulled me over was able to look it up, you know what I'm saying? Or see if, where the fuck. The guy told me he cannot look it up. I have to have it um, not expired or pull it up on my phone, which I don't know how the fuck to do that. So, hour and a half for nothing. So I was like, fuck it. Came back home, washed clothes. Went to do yards at 6 o'clock. 6 to like 8 something. So I got three yards done. Three out of three because one person called and rescheduled uh, for tomorrow. And then my dad said, don't even worry about his. It was really three out of five yards I got done. But same difference. Um... No more slipping, man. Can't, can't, can't keep fucking up.